Hey, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, welcome to another review with me, John. And today I'm going to be reviewing these two Girl Scout cookies. If you notice, this one is called Girl Scout Cookie S'mores. And this one is also called Girl Scout Cookies S'mores. So why are there two Girl Scout Cookie S'mores? Well, if you didn't know, there are actually two separate bakers for Girl Scout Cookies. And they have a couple odd differences. For example, like most people know, there's the Carmelo Lights and there's the Samoas, which are similar but different. In the same way, these two are similar but different. But these are a lot different, I think, than those two, the Carmelo Lights and the Samoas. Um, Carmelo Lights are thinner, um, Samoas are thicker, they have like more caramel, I think, and more coconut on them. But they're the same ingredients, and they're set up to look the same, just in different amounts. Um, some other differences in the bakers, um, for example, the this box, the one that comes in the box, these ones are made by Little Brownie Bakers, and this one, the one that comes in like the plastic sleeve. This one is actually made by ABC Bakery. That's the, the, the two different uh, come the two different bakeries that make Girl Scout cookies. Um, if you go on the website, you'll see which bakery is the one that supplies the Girl Scout cookies near you. Um, as far as I can tell, there's a map. It's not really regional. It's not like one's north, one's south. It's very blotchy. The map that describes what the differences are very blotchy. Um, some other differences, I think, peanut butter patties and tagalongs, they are the exact same cookie, but they have a different name. Um, some cookie varieties are only with one or only with the other. I think like lemonade cookies are only with Brownie Bakery, and I don't know. And then another thing they say that the Thin Mints, although they look exactly the same, uh, one company is actually has more mint than the other. I forget which one that is off the top of my head. But uh, another difference you can see is the packaging. The Brownie Bakery comes in a box. The ABC Bakery comes in a plastic sleeve. From what I can tell online, this is similar throughout all of them. So if you get Thin Mints in a box, it's from the Brownies. If you get Thin Mints in a sleeve, it's from the ABC Company. So let's go ahead and take a look at the physical difference between these two. As you can see, uh, most of these have been eaten. So this is the Brownie Bakery S'mores. So you can see, it says S'mores on the cookie. It is a sandwich cookie. The cookie itself is Graham. And then you can see on one half of the thing has nothing. This half you can see has a white cream, and then, I don't know if I can peel this off, yes I can, see so one half is white, one half is brown. So this is supposed to be chocolate on one side, and marshmallow on the other. I'm going to go ahead and see if I can taste separation. Doesn't really taste like marshmallow. This tastes like white confectioner's cream. And the other half has a chocolatey flavor that's not very rich. Let's go ahead and take a bite of it. Does it taste like a s'more? I wouldn't say that. It does have a very graham crackery flavor. With the cream in the middle, it just kind of tastes like a generic confectioner's cream. Let's go ahead and dunk it in some water. Or not water, milk. 
one test of cookies is always like the dunkability. Like, does it absorb milk enough? Or does it absorb milk too much? Does it taste good with milk? Let's go ahead and taste this one. Even though it absorbs some of the milk, it still stayed nice and crunchy. I think this is definitely uh, dunkable. Before I move on, let's look at the box to see what the differences are on packaging. A little quote up here. Um, I like camping because you can blah blah blah. Girl Scout s'mores, crunchy graham sandwich cookies with a creamy chocolate and marshmallow -y filling. Uh, servings is two cookies. That's seven grams of fat, 150 calories, 21 carbs. Um, total sugars 10 grams, includes 10 added sugars. I don't know what that means. They have the sugar there. It says 10 grams. But then underneath it says added sugar 10 more grams. So. The Girl Scout cookie program on the side there it tells you what uh, badges you can get for selling cookies. And I got this for five dollars. Moving on, we have the ABC s'mores. Let's see what these look like. Instantly, you can see a big difference. On a sandwich, is one piece of cookie and it is coated in chocolate. The description on this package reads, Girl Scout S'mores Crispy Graham Cookie double dipped in yummy cream icing and finished with a scrumptious chocolatey coating. So this one doesn't even say that it's marshmallow. It says cream coating and then chocolate coating. So let's go ahead and break this in half. I don't know if you can see that. Let me try to get more light on it here. Can you see the the edge of inside there that has some cream in it? It's almost not visible. Very thin layer of cream, and it doesn't even go around. I think it's only on top. Let's go ahead and give this one a taste. This one, the main flavor is chocolate. Whereas the, the sandwich cookie, you know, have the graham flavor from the cookie, but not so much chocolate or marshmallow. This one, you get a lot of chocolate. You still taste the graham. Um, the cream, hmm, you don't really taste it. Let's go ahead and do the dunk test for this one. Even though I broke that in half and dunked it with some of the cookie exposed, it still didn't absorb a lot of the milk. Back I need to sip a little milk to get just a cleansed new palate. Um, on this package, you see it has the Girl Scout cookie program on that side, it has the badges that you can get right there. So similar parts of packaging. You have the badge part, you have the Girl Scout program written on the package. Let's check the nutritional facts and see how they differ. Two cookies, 180 calories, so a little more calories in this one. Nine grams of fat, a little more fat. 25 grams of carbs, which is 16 grams of sugar. Now, Still don't know exactly how much sugar these ones have. Is it 20? So it says 10 grams. Total sugar is 10 grams. Includes 10 gram added sugars. This one just says 16. Maybe this one just has 10 and they just worded it weird. 
Hmm. Just one last thing that you could do. Stack them together and eat them as one. The ultimate Girl Scout s'more cookie. It's hard to bite through. I don't think either one is a s'more, really. If I had to choose one that I like more, probably this one uh, that has a richer chocolate flavor to it. This one you don't really taste the chocolate much at all. The only advantage this one has is the dunkability. So if you like to dunk your cookies, get this one. If you prefer more richer chocolate, get this one. But mostly you're just going to get the one that's in your area. I bought this one on Amazon and it was about $9. So with shipping you're almost paying twice as much. And is it worth it? Well, it's up to you, the consumer. I really wish they would sell them online. That way you can do it either one. Now, they do have an online purchasing program, but you have to know a Girl Scout who's using it. It's not just a general public online store. Each individual Girl Scout can open their own mobile uh, app that they can sell. But they need to give you like a specific code to do it. I don't know any Girl Scouts and I'm not going to go searching for one. So I'm just going to pay $9 for someone on Amazon. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this Girl Scout cookie comparison video. And until next time, guys, bye.